the aircraft carrier Admiral Kuznetsov will be armed with the latest anti-aircraft missile and artillery complex as Panzer M. Sources in the military department told Izvestia. In addition, a new integrated air defense control system will be introduced on the ship. It will automatically recognize targets, divide them between anti-aircraft complexes and destroy them. Shells with a new control system are capable of repelling massive attacks on the ship by all means of attack, ranging from airplanes and helicopters to anti-ship missiles and drones. Also, according to the interlocutors of the publication, special rooms have already been built on board the ship, in which high-precision aviation weapons for the Kuznetsov air wing will be stored, serviced and prepared for combat use. We are talking about air-launched cruise missiles, as well as adjustable and homing bombs. Currently, the Admiral Kuznetsov Air Defense consists of four launchers of the console anti-aircraft missile system. It can simultaneously fire at four targets at a distance of up to 12 kilometers and at an altitude of up to 6 kilometers. Also, eight anti-aircraft missile and artillery complexes Dirk are responsible for the ship's air defense. The range of the missiles is up to 8 kilometers. At close range, the Dirk uses two six-barreled AO-18K guns. In addition, six AK-630 M6 barrel 30mm rapid-fire launchers with a rate of 5,000 rounds per minute are placed on board. Panzer M is replacing the older Cutlasses. Now it is the most advanced ship-based anti-aircraft air defense system. In the arsenal of the Marine shell there are eight missiles and two six-barreled 30mm rapid-firing automatic guns. It is capable of hitting targets flying at altitudes from one meter to several tens of kilometers. With it, Admiral Kuznetsov will be more protected from air attacks. Panzer M can shoot down any type of targets in the near zone. There is no better system for naval air defense today and the new ammunition for the air wing will make it an even more formidable ship. In general, the modernization of the cruiser consists in the fact that all systems are removed from it and the most modern ones are installed instead. Also this year, deliveries to the aviation parts of the line of ultra-precise long-range bombs began. It includes several models capable of hitting targets at a distance of tens of kilometers. They differ in their mass, range of application, as well as the correction and guidance system. Bombs are capable of destroying both ground targets and moving objects, including armored ones, with extreme accuracy. The advantage of planning ammunition is that they are much cheaper than guided missiles with comparable accuracy. In addition, due to the lack of a rocket engine and fuel, the bomb can carry a more massive warhead. The ongoing special military operation clearly shows that planning bombs and modern guided missiles are what is needed, Dmitry Boltenkov told Izvestia. And most importantly, aircraft can use them without entering the enemy's air defense zone. Thus, the aircraft carrier can solve the tasks of hitting surface and ground targets, and the range of its carrier-based aircraft increases. Earlier, Izvestia was informed that a crew is being formed for Admiral Kuznetsov, which has been undergoing repairs and modernization in recent years. It is planned to recruit more than 1,000 sailors, midshipmen and officers. In addition to purely maritime positions, motorists, navigators, signal men, the crew will be equipped with specialists in the operation and maintenance of aviation equipment and equipment. After completion of manning, the crew will undergo training and coordination and then he will conduct all the tests of the ship, which is due to return to the fleet in 2024.